folks are just looking for a hand. All we gotta do is offer. I'll keep that in mind. Yep, I will. Hello, Wastelanders. It is I, Big Papa J. Standing here, well, not standing, I'm sitting here in my office. I'm Batman. And the guy in front of me, you guys know who that is. That is Mr. Kellogg. I didn't kill him. He is a companion who I'm not going to be taking out onto adventures with, not at the moment, but maybe one day. Okay, I did a couple things off camera. I had to add in another magazine rack because this one's almost full. I got, what, five, six more slots, and I'm going to have to start a new one. So, yeah, been finding a lot of magazines out in my adventures. I've only got three bobbleheads, so I need to get me a few more bobbleheads, but I will. Anywho, who's a good dog? Who's a good dog? He's a good dog. Yeah, you know any tricks? Hey, boy. Huh? Yeah, you doing okay, boy? You want to talk? Hey, boy. Hey, you want to talk? You know any tricks? Uh, everything okay? Everything okay, boy. Yeah. Uh, you don't want to do no tricks for me? Okay, don't worry, Dommy. Just saying hello. <laughs> I don't have my cats. I, should, I need to get my cats, you know. In my other mod, I had four cats. What you doing in there? Anywho, let's go out into the wasteland, shall we? Okay, I got to figure out what I want to do next. Because I got so much stuff to do. I still need to uh, hook up with the railroad. I need to do that. Um, let me see. I, I still need to build that molecular thingamajiggy so I can get into the wasteland. Oh, I mean, not the wasteland. Get into the institute. Let's bring up my tab here. I always say bring up my tab because it's the tab key. The tab key is what brings up your pit boy. So when I say bring up my tab, I'm meaning bring up my pit boy. Uh, data, let me see. Report your power and dance. Um, these, there, build that. Which I think I want to do that with the railroad. I haven't made contact with um, the Minutemen yet. I haven't even talked to them yet. That's Far Harbor. Um, this is... Um, Outcast and Remnants, because I need to do that. I need to get that going, actually. I do need to get that going. That's the railroad. That's talk to Stella. That might be fun. Might be fun to go talk to Stella. And Freedom Calls. Um, that's the Minutemen into the museum. Like a good neighbor. I, ooh, I need to do that, too. I got Rude Awakening, that's the America Rising, and then Miscellaneous. You know what? I think, I think what I want to do, I think I want to go ahead and get Freedom Trail, get the railroad um, involved. You cannot fast travel when enemies are nearby. Yeah, 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 I know that. I know that. I just have to... Step away from my shop. You have to step away from your from the door. You can't be standing right at the door. It won't let you. It won't let you fast travel. Okay, R. Um. Follow the Freedom Trail. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know where the Freedom Trail is. It's over here at the North Church. Uh, up here. It's up here at the North Church. I already know where it is. So let's just fast travel to the North Church. How is everybody today? I'm fabulous. I'm on a three-day holiday. Today is Saturday. For those who may not know, it is Saturday. And Monday is a holiday. So this is a three-day weekend for me here in Thailand. Talking about Thailand... I'm going to be releasing a video. It's not going to be a game video. It's not going to have nothing to do with Fallout 4. There's the Pidrin. Brotherhood of Steel right there. But I'm going to release a video on being a teacher here in Thailand. Things, get things, you know. It's just going to be a... Uh, it's going to have um, a walkabout of Thailand playing in the background. 
for you to watch, visually to watch. And it'll be various um, areas of Thailand from Bangkok to Phuket to Chiang Mai to whatever. Now, these are not videos that I took personally. These are videos um, that another um, YouTuber has posted and it's he has video tons and tons and tons of videos from all around the world but he gives permission to use his videos he says right in his description right in his um, show notes and um, in the licensing reuse act licensing he clearly says that um, you are free to use his videos just don't we upload them directly. This means, in English, don't just take his video, we upload it and claim it as yours. You are free to use his videos. He just asks that you um, improve it, make changes to it, do something to it. Don't just upload it and, and be done with it. Which is fine. Because that's what I plan on doing. I plan on what I plan on doing is showing his videos, and I will link mine now in the show notes. I will link in the show notes back to the, his, back to the original video, back to his video, so that anybody who wants to check out the original work by him can do so. So I will link back. But anyway, back to what I was saying is, I'll have his video playing in the background, and then I will come, uh, talk, and I will be talking about. How to become a teacher in Thailand. Just different aspects. The move here, what to do, what you need to bring with you, what legal requirements, um, culture here in Thailand, what, what is the culture like, what to expect, and so forth, yada, yada. So it'll be a pretty interesting video. And I might do multiple videos on that subject about teaching in Thailand. For those who don't know, I've been a teacher here in Thailand for going on seven years. I moved here in 2017, and I've been teaching ever since. I've been teaching since 2017. I've taught at government school as well as... Well, that's over. Bloody liquor scared the bloody bejesus out of me. I've taught at government school as well as at an international school. It's the international school is where I teach now. I've been at the international school for a while. In fact, at one point in time, I got promoted to head of section. I was head teacher for English, math, and science. It was only for one year. And then um, yes. I got put back into, because I was doing primary teaching and head of section at the same time. This is a pretty big workload trying to keep up with everything so I only did that for one year and then I went back to just teaching full-time as a permanent teacher but I enjoyed my time as head of teacher I enjoyed it anywho so be, you can be looking for that video it's in the works I'm working on it I haven't got it completed yet so it, it is in the works but I will be releasing that for anybody who would just like a laid-back um, video of Thailand, a tour of Thailand for those who haven't been here yet, or maybe you have, and you just want to revisit old memories, plus a complete guide on becoming a teacher if you ever decided to do that. Okay, let's we'll meet. All be better off without you around. Yeah, we'll all be better off if I shut up and get back to the quest. <laughs> let's open up the um the door here so i need to type in railroad mm, spins. r so let's start with r a I dead as can be. Hell. Well, now I need another R. Here we go. R. O. A. Now I need to 
D and the D's all the way back around over here. D. Now, for those who don't know, I've, I've done this so many times, I know what the code is, Railroad. For those who don't know, if you actually follow the Freedom Trail, this is kind of tedious in and of itself, but if you follow it, it will give you the clues on what you need to put in there. Okay, so we are here. Let's make contact with the railroad. Not one foot closer. Stop right there. You went through a lot of effort to arrange this meeting. But before we go any further, answer my questions. Who the hell are you? I'm Batman. <laughs> Why don't you tell me who you are first? You wanted to see us. So that means you're playing by our rules. So, answer my question. Why aren't you the little bits? Hmm. I followed the Freedom Trail looking for the railroad. I'm not your enemy. If that's true, you have nothing to fear. Who told you how to contact us? Dr. Amari told me how to find you. Very interesting. Last question. Why are you here? I tracked down and killed a courser at Green Tech Genetics. Now I need help breaking the code on his courser chip. You have what? This is not a joking matter. I didn't know we were having a party. What gives with my invitation? Oh, I see you invited the courser killer. Nice. Deacon. You're late. You're saying this intruder actually killed a courser? Single-handedly? <laughs> oh, that'd give even Gloria a run for her money. Newsflash, boss. This guy is kind of a big deal. If you're done interrogating him, you might want to show this courser murdering machine a little courtesy. Hmm? Just a thought. I owe you an apology. Anyone who kills a courser is good in my book. I'm Desdemona. And I'm the leader of the railroad. Hopefully we can work something out. What you're asking for puts us in a tricky position. Des, we need to let him in. He's got an intact courser chip, for God's sake. That violates our security protocols. To hell with that! He killed a courser. There's no way he's working for the Institute. We're letting you into our headquarters. You're the first outsider ever to be given this privilege. We'll discuss the details about your chip inside. Awesome. Okay. So, I want to talk to Deacon. Hey there. We having fun yet? But you're not going to let me talk to you. Don't okay. Anything, stranger. I do what I do. If you don't like it, tough. Okay. So, let's go on inside the headquarters, shall we? That was easy. I guess killing the course of shit before coming here makes a big difference. That makes a big difference doing that before instead of after. Well, what's going on with the data? It says talk to Desmond. Okay, well, I'm trying to talk, but where's she at? Where is she? There she is. Right, some ground rules. Tom can get you the code, but once he's done, we get the courser chip. Why do you want the courser chip? Institute Tech is light years beyond what we have, and a courser chip is top of the line. I'm not going to get into details, but that ship could help us save lives. Maybe throw a wrench in some of the Institute's operations. So, hand over the chip. Fine. It's yours. All right. Tom, make it happen. Where are you at, Tom? There you are, Tinker Tom. Okay.
we're in. Chip access. Just hope the analog can make this a little. What? Oh man, don't, don't don't crash. Hold it together. Memory hiccup. Here it comes. Encryption algorithms. All right. All right, we're still running. Oh man. They've added more decimals to the last cipher. This is gonna be. Come on, baby. Show me that pattern. Where is it? Wait. They're using the same logarithmic function as the key generator. Oh man, we got lucky. I got you, you institute bastard. I got you. Come on. Show me that sweet bass number. Come on, baby. Then we got it. We got the code. <laughs> Let me load that onto the hollow tape for ya. Hey. Don't try anything, stranger. Whatever. Ah, Whatever. shut up. Okay. Now, what do we got here? Talk to Desiree again? Okay, where'd, where'd she bloody go? Where'd she go this time? Railroad agent. Um, Railroad agent. Hey, don't try anything, stranger. I ah, shut up. I'm getting tired of you guys telling me what to do. I'm gonna blow you guys as smithereenies. Just, just saying. You guys are all dead. Maybe not today. Maybe not tomorrow. But you guys are all dead. Okay. Where in the hell did she go? There she is. Hey there. If we're going to be dealing more with each other, I need to make sure that we're on the same page. You know what a synth is, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know all about them. Good. The Institute treats synths as property, as tools. Aren't synths just machines? And machines are tools. They started that way. But if it's impossible to tell a single difference between a synth and a human, they must be treated the same. So we seek to free the synths from their bondage. Give them a chance at a real life. I have a question. The only question that matters. Would you risk your life for your fellow man? Even if that man is a synth? Once, I pledged my life to protect my countrymen. I don't see this as any different. Well said. Someone with your skills, your beliefs, normally we'd try and recruit you. But right now, we don't have the time to train up a new agent. There are, however, other valuable ways you can contribute. And in turn, we can help you. See Deacon for details. You're free to go. Alrighty. So let's go talk to Deacon. Here we go. Excuse me. Hope you didn't mind the reception. When you tango with the Institute, you gotta be careful when someone new gets on the dance floor. Um... Your leader was just being cautious. Exactly. Kind of killed our chance at a friendly first impression, though. But it's all good now. I vouched for you. Nobody got shot. Still, I would consider it a close personal favor if you didn't sell us out to the Institute. Thanks. Don't worry, I'm not gonna sell you out. I'm gonna end up killing all of you. <laughs> Don't worry, I'll keep your secret. That's what I want to hear. So Des wants me to make you a tourist. That's what we call someone. I'm thinking about wiping out the Institute, the Railroad, the Minutemen, the Brotherhood of Steel. Wiping out everybody and re instating the Enclave. That's kind of where I'm leaning. But, you know, anything could happen. You got my attention. I got a job. Too big for me, just perfect for the two of us. You help me out, we turn a few heads, and then Dez invites you into the fold. Then, if you get into a bind and need some help, your buddies in the railroad got your back. <laughs> Sign me up. Sign me up then. Perfecto. Let's meet up at the old freeway outside of Lexington. I'll fill you in once you get there. Meet Deacon at the old highway. I can do that. I can do that. Okay, let's turn my light on so I can bloody see. Meet Deacon at the old highway. So I gotta get out of this joint first. There 
is over there. Right there she blows. There's the door. Oh, whitey. Also, I talked to you about I'm going to be releasing a video on teaching in Thailand. I'm pretty excited about that. I'm already working on it. I, I've been working on it. It's something I've been doing, actually been thinking about um, for about a year now. I've been thinking about doing it. And I've finally, finally decided to pull the trigger. But I'm also thinking about doing something else on the side, outside of gaming, Fallout 4, and that's reaction videos. I'm still on the fence with that one. Um, let's see, data, tradecraft, or I guess. Rudy's Diner might be a good one. Or Raiden's Pond. Raiden's Pond might be a good one. I think we'll jump into Raiden's Pond. We'll jump into Raiden's Pond and work away at work. Um, but, reaction video, because I really love doing reaction videos. Um, I like watching them. I haven't done any, but I like watching them. And it, it might be fun to watch them and then record my talk ooh I need I need blood. See my blood dot? Record me talking and reacting to the videos. That might be that might be fun, might be entertaining for me. It may not be for you. Oh, I've already been here. I've already been here. It might not be entertaining for you guys, but it will be for me. It'll, it'll be fun and entertaining for me. <coughs> Sorry about that. And as you guys know. Ooh. Where'd you come from, Saka? Hey, let's see. Is there anything? Ooh, there's some bourbon. Oh, bourbon to Papa. Yeah, come to Papa. Come to Papa. Okay, we gotta make our way down over here towards Deacon. I've been doing a lot of excess running around over here. Oh, there's some more zombies down there. Not anymore. Oh, some more zombies. Let's do this. Yeah, let's do this. You know, I kind of miss. I'm one of my own solo. I kind of miss having a companion. What the hell? Thought somebody walked up behind me. I did. I thought there was somebody up behind me. I didn't, couldn't see. I kind of miss having a companion because I like talking with my companions. You know, when they say something and then I say something back and reply. I kind of enjoy doing that too. I probably should start craving somebody around with me. I don't know, maybe Harley. I could bring Piper with me. I always ran with Piper in the past. I might, I might start doing that, or I might continue just running solo. Anywho, let's see, where is Mr. Deacon? Where are you, Mr. Deacon? Over here, okay. 77, 75 meters away. I'm assuming that's meters. That's how I've always um, looked at it. I've always thought it was like meters, like 70, 50 meters, 70 meters, 100 meters. That's what I've always counted it as. It may not be, but I don't know. Sounds good to me. Sounds good to me calling it. Ooh, more zombs. Tango down. Tango down. Okay. Deacon, is that you? Are you in combat? Who are you fighting over here? Yeah, he's fighting somebody. I don't see nobody. 
He's fighting somebody, but I don't see him on the radar. What the bloody hell are you shooting at? Hmm. What are you shooting at, Deke? Attack! Hey. Do what you gotta do. Hey. There must be somebody over here. I'm the last human you're ever gonna lay eyes on. Are you shooting at the bloody deer? Is that what your buddy's shooting at? You're not leaving here. Peace. Dead as can be. Okay, I don't know what he was shooting at. He's still shooting at something. Must be a zombie. Oh, there we go. Tango down. No. Tango not down. Tango down. Tango down. I th okay, I think we got it, Deke. Now, where are you, young man? There you are. Okay. Perfect. Okay, tango down. Okay, Mr. Deacon. You know what? We are at the one minute mark. I think. How are you doing? Hey. <laughs> you mind stop walking away from me? Deacon? Is that you? Like the disguise? It's Wastelander Camo. This is my pile of garbage, asshole. Back off. Good, right? <laughs> You're lucky I didn't do one of my face swaps, too. Interesting. You can do a face swap? Wow. You can change your face? I put myself under the knife every year or two. New face, new body. You know, the full makeover. It keeps our enemies guessing. Mm-hmm. Interesting. I almost didn't recognize you. That's the point. So, about the job. The railroad's only recently been using the old North Church. Our old base was underneath the Slocum's Joe. We had a pretty sweet setup until the Institute found us. Really? Your base was under a donut shop? <laughs> Your base was under a donut shop? It's a lot better than it sounds. Well, it was, until it was blown to hell. What happened? Our HQ was strong, defensible. Heck, we thought it was secure. Inside a minute, the Institute troopers breached the doors and turned it into a shooting gallery. The survivors didn't have time to grab anything. So we're getting something important we had to leave behind. Okay, well let's find it. Let's find it then. We gotta do one thing first. We got a tourist nearby. He or she has information on the base. So let's pump him for information before we dive in. For now, I'll take point. Okay. So looking for rail signs, symbols we use to send messages to each other. If you like that, we got signs and counter signs, dead drops, even a secret handshake. All right, maybe the handshake never got on. Anyway, the tourist should have a trail left for us. Here we go. Sweet. Rail sign. The arrow in the center indicates a direction. So our tourist is up ahead. Let's keep going. Okay. I'm following you. I drop down into sneak mode just so I can turn on the night vision so we can see better. The tourist is somewhere on this freeway. Let's find out. Thanks to you, yes. <laughs> Bloody hell! That liquor doesn't want to go down. He's pretty damn tough. Another one. How many bloody zombies are on this bloody mountain? Or, not mountain, bridge. What the bloody hell? Wow. Let's get this. The tourist is somewhere on the street. I hope you're right. We gotta check out the zombies first, Deke. Good lord, there's like a hundred of them. Okay. I'm not gonna worry about loot. I will loot that, that's my ammo. I'm not gonna worry about the, the other loot. 
Just checking to make sure there ain't no more of my ammo floating around. Danger for breakfast. Taste like chicken. Uh oh, that car is fixing a booey. I love blowing cars up at night. I love blowing cars up at night. It is so cool. Anytime I have the opportunity to blow cars up at night, I love doing it. Okay. Who's the bloody Deacon? Hey, Deke. What the hell are you doing back here, boy? Young man. Whatever you are. Come on. We have a mission to do. Don't have time for you to sit here and... Whatever it is you're doing. Is that a raider or a zombie? Another zombie. I need a bloody raider. Big Papa's hungry. I need a raider. I gotta eat. And another. We're probably close. You think so? Okay, well, will you stop? Just stand in there. Pull your finger out of your butt and let's walk. Come on. Keep walking. Thank you. Ugh. Deacon's gonna be the death of me. That's why I don't crave companions. They're dingleberries. <laughs> Keep walking, Deke. More bloody zombies. Center, that means there's an ally nearby. Our what? Teams. Whatever, keep walking. Oops, I just shot my tourist <laughs> and blew him up. <laughs> I shot him. You just say, Mine. I shot him and blew him up. Oh, so funny. So funny. I shot and blew him up. <laughs> okay, let's go talk to this tourist real quick. Once your friend gets here. How about we have a chat, huh? Huh? <laughs> well, I'm here. Yeah. Oh, thank God. You have a Geiger counter? You have a goddamn Geiger counter? Yes, I do. Calm down. Mine is in the shop. Who the hell is he? HQ said they were sending one agent, not two. Sorry, I'm new. He's just showing me the ropes. All right. The wall is my witness. I thought I was dead. It's about goddamn time you headquarters bastards got here. Mm-hmm. Ease up there, pal, or we're gonna have a problem. I already got problems, asshole. That little Slocum's Joe of yours is crawling with goddamn chrome dome synth sons of bitches. The front's fortified to hell and back. They place mines all over the goddamn place. <laughs> Tell me what you really think. Good to know. I'll be going. Yeah. As soon as it's safe, I'm getting the hell out of here. So if you need anything else, better ask soon. <laughs> that guy's having a very bad day. That's the Corvega plant. Yeah, I've been there multiple times. <laughs> yeah, that guy is having a very bad day. <laughs> <clears throat> well, isn't Ricky just a ray of sunshine? You think he's telling the truth? He doesn't strike me as the dishonest type. Yeah, that's my read, too. First rule in this business is never go against your gut. So, if we take him at his word, the front door has mines, synths, and probably other fun and exciting prizes. So, we're going in through the escape tunnel. <laughs> the donut shop? The donut shop has an escape tunnel? What? Doesn't everyone have an escape tunnel? Seriously, though? Thank God for that tunnel. If it weren't for that, there wouldn't be any railroad left. Okay, well, let's move. Let's move out. You lead us there, pal. I got you covered. How am I going to lead? I didn't even know you had a bloody escape tunnel. You want me You want me to lead you to the escape tunnel that I don't even know about? 
Oh, how funny, how funny, how funny. Okay, well, we're not going to go to the escape tunnel yet. We will go on the next episode. And with that being said, this is Big Papa Jay. Hoping you're having a good day or night, depending on what it is where you are. I'm out of here.